Hello, it's Ultimate DS Man, and I originally wasn't gonna make a video uh, about this topic because um, when when this first happened, when news first broke about the redesign leak, um, it was just a leak. Now, personally, I actually believed it. It looked pretty damn legit to me. Um, and usually, when film leaks happen, um, there's a purpose to it. Like they want to see reactions of how people like it or dislike it um now leaks with video games are way different in that regard but in terms of movies like leaks they're usually like not all the time obviously but um you know they're usually the, uh the real deal so um a while ago the redesign for the sonic movie or sonic for the sonic movie uh got leaked and I didn't make a video about it at the time because it was a leak. It wasn't. It could have been fake, so that's why I didn't say anything on the matter. Um, besides Twitter, I was like, "Oh my God, you know, it looks amazing." But um, today, someone found a Sonic movie standee, and I'm not sure if this is a movie theater or some type of mall. But someone took a picture of it, and it has that same redesign. My boys, there's no fucking way this is fake anymore. This pretty much confirms that that redesign is real. Oh my god. Now, here's the thing. Some people are still concerned because there's some small differences between the standee and the leak we got previously. Now, if you do compare them, they do look a tad bit different, but you could pretty much tell that, like, they tweaked a little bit of things here and there. But it's pretty much the same damn thing. It's it's the same Sonic. Um, and we even get a look at his, like, shoes, which we originally didn't. But, um, it's finally time for me to share my thoughts and opinions on this redesign. And I am... I am... So <laughs> oh my god! I'm in love. I love this Sonic. He looks fucking fresh, dog. Oh my god. I'm home alone right now, so I'm popping off. Dude, he looks so good. Now, I know this is kind of a lame video. It's like, oh my god, he looks good. Okay, thanks for watching. <laughs> but, like, I wanted to give you guys my opinion as a Sonic YouTuber man. Um, because it's the Sonic movie. Like, this is a huge deal. Like, ever since I was a kid, I've always wanted, like, a Sonic movie, uh, in some fashion and whatnot, and it's just crazy that, like, we're getting that now, like, officially, and, uh, like, they're, oh, God, and they're doing it justice, too, man, it's just, <sighs> now, the thing is, it's like, I know someone's gonna bring this up, because it is true, it's a good point, um, the writing isn't gonna change, <laughs> like, it's just... The only thing that has changed is just Sonic in his design. That's it. Like, the writing and everything else is going to be the same. Um, it's just, like, it's just the fact that they went back and, like, fixed him <laughs> and made him look way better. It's just, it gives the movie a lot more bonus points, in my opinion. Like, it gives a lot more, like, okay, they do care, you know? Um... It's just, like, the, the thing with me, though, is, like, this movie could suck ass, <laughs> okay? The writing could be fucking terrible, but look at, fucking look at him. I want to see him. I want to see that Sonic so bad. Look how good he looks. I don't give a fuck if that writing is dog shit, okay? We've already had to put up with dog shit fucking writing in modern Sonic games, okay? Um, even though I do think, um, Forces had some pretty good writing, despite some characterization issues like Tails, but the writing in Forces wasn't that bad. Lost World's writing sucked dick. I hated it, even though I love that game. Uh, the writing was terrible. Anyways, uh, what was I talking about? Yeah, the writing could suck left nut, but I will still go and see that movie by myself as a 21-year-old fucking adult. To see that fucking Sonic on the big screen. Look how good- I- I love that design. They gave him gloves! They actually- I was not expecting that. They gave him fucking gloves, and his shoes look fucking sick, dog. And, like, his proportions, too. Like, he looks very stubby and small. 
And I love that. It's like a mix of like classic boom and modern all into one little Oh, I fucking love him. Dude, if oh, when they make merch of this, oh, it's over. Like I know since the redesign happened, like a lot of stuff has been affected by it, like the merchandise and costumes and plushies figures and everything else has probably been uh, affected by the redesign, but I really do think that this is like, well everyone can agree <laughs> that this is definitely for the better and it gives a movie a lot more of a fighting chance in terms of reputation and um, you know imagine if they didn't fucking change it dog like could you fucking imagine a shitstorm the Sonic brand will be in like fucking the thing is is like when stuff like this happens in films and just things like this that are a big deal for franchises it affects the entire brand as a whole so like if that if they fucking kept that original design oh my god dude the Sonic brand like it would It'd be shaken up a little bit like it's nothing new for Sonic but like still man like Sonic in my opinion has been on a really like steady road and I've been very proud of him uh, I, I say that like I like like I say that like he's a real person <laughs> like he just got a rehab or something but no like like Sonic Mania forces Team Sonic Racing the new comics and new animations we've got I'm been, like really digging the content they've been putting out even though um not everyone liked Team Sonic Racing. I personally enjoyed it, but uh, it's just my biggest problem is just they didn't really support the game after launch. It's like okay, it's out. Uh, you know, have fun online when it works. <laughs> you know, it's like come on, like uh, I love that game though, but like what the fuck? Come on, um, they're never gonna update that game. Anyways, this fucking design, dude. Like, could you imagine if they kept the original design? Like, okay, in my personal opinion. You guys can judge me. But like that, the original design was kind of growing on me a little bit. But fucking Christ, when you go back and compare it, it's just... It's night and day, dude. Like, uh, like I feel kind of bad <laughs> liking it a little bit <laughs> beforehand. Like, okay, it's just, in my opinion, I think in some shots he did look okay and kind of cute, actually. But in others, he looked fucking terrible, dude. And it's just like... In some shots, he looks okay and good, and sometimes, some shots, he looks awful. And you guys already know what shot I'm referring to in terms of the awful one, the flashlight scene, the you know the fucking uh, the scene that got shared around a lot is like, oh my god, you know, it's so bad. But God, when you compare the two designs, though, it's just night and day. Like one's just Sonic, and the other one's like weird, like muscle dude with a sonic head a little scoop boy it's just so well weird like some of the posters look cool honestly but like it's still like even then like it, i say that and like i do mean it it's just like it's still not ideal you know it's still not sonic it's just a weird blue dude <laughs> you know it's not sonic the fucking hedgehog it's a weird little scoop boy run around naked like you know it's just weird it's like uncanny valley it's just fucking weird god this new design is so much better i cannot wait to see this motherfucker in motion i'm gonna fall in love with a sonic and ben schwartz is gonna fucking voice him oh man like even if the writing's fucking dog shit dude i am still gonna see this movie and i've actually been thinking about um after i watch the movie like in theaters i'll like make a thoughts kind of video like me literally recording in my car just talking about the movie i might do that i actually do have a friend a college friend that likes sonic too so maybe i can ask her if she want to uh watch the movie or whatever but i i don't know um but this fucking redesign dude like holy shit it, it's just sonic i love the proportions it's like classic sonic Boom Sonic and Modern Sonic mash into one. And it's just, I love it. I can't believe they gave him, like, shoes like that, too. Like, it's not, like, one-to-one -one accurate Modern Sonic, but it's pretty damn close. Like, this is as close as we're gonna get. And the blue arms, I don't give a fuck about that. Okay, that's dumb. Like, people still complain about that. Like, I never understood why blue arms was, like, a big 
thing to begin with when Boom came out because like like the only reason why Sonic has tan arms is because so like his arms would stand out on the 16 bit uh, bit sprite so like if that wasn't an issue with the Genesis he classic Sonic would have had blue arms from the beginning so shut up <laughs> like who fucking cares at this point he looks sick I fucking love him uh, I'm not sure what else to talk about. I can't believe, like, God, I just can't imagine what would have happened if they would have just said, No, we're gonna still go with this. This is good. Fucking push it out the door. Like a fucking child. Child labor with a blue fucking fuck. I don't know what I'm talking about, dude. I'm popping off. But, uh, God damn. It's just crazy. I'm so... I'm really fucking excited for the Sonic movie now, dude. I am so pumped. Oh, I want to see him. He looks so cute. I, I love him. I, I love him. I want, like, a family of him. I want... I, I want to see him. He's a good boy. Oh. God, I want the merch, too. God, I'm such a... Dork. Fuck. I'm 21, <laughs> by the way. Oh, man. He looks so good! Alright, I'm sorry. Um, what do you all think of the new Sonic design? Uh, watch this be confirmed as, like, bullshit or something. They made that somehow, and this is all fake or something. I highly doubt that because, again, with film leaks like this, they're usually, like, they're usually, like, on point. So, and plus, I heard we might, uh, get a new trailer soon as well. So, uh, expect me to watch that as well. Um, yeah, I just waited to make this video because I wasn't sure if it was real or not. And this pretty much confirms that it's actually real. So, I wanted to make a video about it. Um, sorry if it's not the most outstanding video. It's just like, oh, it's the, you know, <laughs> you know, it's generic Sonic Tuber kind of thing. But, uh, what do you all think about the new, uh, redesign and stuff? I think it's really cool. I'm, I'm really excited. Oh man, I love fuck. God, I love fuck. I love Sonic, dude. God, he looks so good. Fuck my ass, dude. <laughs> oh, he looks so good. Well, what do you all think of the new design? Are you excited for the Sonic movie now? Uh, I definitely am. A hundred percent. I am totally on board with that boy. I wanna, I wanna see that boy. I don't care if the writing's garbage. I don't give a fuck. I want to see him. <laughs> you know, I'm willing to take that risk. Um, yeah. Holy fuck, dude. This is nuts. What a crazy ass timeline we live in. Anyways, uh, what do you all think of him? Uh, what do you all think of the new good-looking boy? And uh, yeah, what do you all think of the Sonic movie too? Um, so I guess this is Ultimate DS Man. Uh, sleep deprived and at 5 a.m. right now. Yeah, uh, sign the fuck off and uh, thanks for watching